Hello and welcome to what I hope to be a new series which I'm going to launch on YouTube. Um, I've had a lot of success on Instagram with my Penguin Book A Day feed and I'd like to extend that onto YouTube. The main reasons of course with Instagram you've just got 15 seconds to show your video and I know this is a massive step up from just a photo but on the other hand I think with the books I'd like to show you, I can give a bit more detail and depth to what I'd like to, to show with a, an unlimited length video. So YouTube, I think, is the way to go. Um, so welcome. And here is my first one, which is The Penguin Handyman. So this book was published in 1945. And the reason I'm featuring it today is because I think, I'm pretty sure, it's the thinnest penguin that was ever published. Um, there really isn't a lot to it. Um, you see it's about half a centimetre in width. Um, its number was PH9. Um, and there really, it really is quite a thin little book. Um, it came out just after the war, so paper rationing was still in evidence. Um, and you can see the pages, they're almost see-through. Um, and that's that's one of the reasons, although there are only 84 pages in total, that's the main reason is because it was under wartime economy standards and uh, paper was rationed, although Penguin got more than its fair share of allowance. Um, so there you are, quite an interesting little book, um, very much of its time. This copy, I think, must be an export one because there's no usual, the usual British price would be there. And someone's had to put a sticker on the original bookshop, would have put a sticker on top of that one but there's no bookshop, uh, normal bookshop price on there. So quite a little interesting book, and as I said, I believe the thinnest penguin around. So, if you enjoy this, and you'd like to see a few more of these videos, I'm certainly up for filming them, as and when time allows. Um, I'll still keep Instagram going, of course, um, since that's where most of my followers are. But I think for the longer videos, such as, you know, recently when I was covering uh, my Beatles paperbacks. Uh, I mean, that took like four videos to show and, you know, it'd be much better to do just nice, one nice long, I don't know, 10 minute video showing them all off um, and in a bit more detail as well. So if you want these to continue, please subscribe to my channel, uh, like up the video, leave a comment would be nice. Um, and thank you very much for watching. Uh, so my second video, I've actually got a competition a nice, uh, nice wartime vintage penguin, which I'm going to give away. So see you soon. Bye.